You like that? <laughs> no. Amber's never really been in my bathroom. She hates being in here, and that's where we are right now, and she just stole some of my nail polish. Yeah. I play it. It's like tan colored, so it looks like my skin. So, I don't know, it's kind of cool. Like, I wish you guys can see what's going on in this shower tub that she can't even use because it's. I don't know full what she's talking about. I trash. use my shower every day. There's not trash. Oh, okay. In here. Here's a shower. Let's just show you guys one thing. I yeah, found cotton Q tips in the shower. Because I put that them in there. That just tells you. Some, no. Oh, found cotton balls. Yeah, no, because I'm not in a shower oh, right what is now. This? So this it's, was in the shower. It's my box for my scrub brush. Okay. Because I'm not taking a shower right now, so I have it in there as storage. This is Bay, and she's here with me today because we're gonna do girlfriend tag. Oh, we are. Yeah. Great. Well, kind of. I'm not sure if I'm doing it wrong, but I just asked you guys to send me some questions, so I'm mm -hmm. just gonna read them straight off of the YouTube comments. Yeah. We did one a long time ago on my page, but I think yeah. it's an, an updated version needs to happen, so let's do it. Oh, this is Chanel, this our, is our daughter. daughter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so enough lollygagging. Let's get right into it. So, how long have you been together? We just had two and a half years. Damn. What's the best slash worst thing about being together? I mean, Kira's really messy and she likes things to be hectic when I like things to be planned out and go smooth. And I'm clean. Okay. It's just that me and Amber, we have very different personalities, so. Right. She just learned how to be in a real relationship outside yeah, of herself. Yeah, no, that's true. That's Care what I'm selfish. To say. You know what I mean? She's gone her whole life thinking yeah. about only herself. So it was, it was really tough trying to get her to think about somebody else. Also. Exactly. She just took the words right out of my brain. That's what I was trying to say. You and know? the frustrating part was for me is like I feel like that's an automatic when you get in a relationship, right? So oh. I'm like, wait, why don't you do this? No, a lot of no, a lot of people are in relationships with other people that have a really hard time like thinking beyond themselves and like a lot of people have a hard time admitting their faults and mm -hmm. I think that's like a common issue yeah but um, one thing I learned just to always be open and always listen when we would get in disagreements I was just waiting for her to shut up so that I could prove her wrong but now like when she says something to me I actually listen I'm like oh okay I can see like why she would feel that way and was I ever wrong or Honestly, Amber's not wrong. Most, <laughs> most of the time, you're not wrong. That was the and so that was really the struggle hard. right there, you guys. No. It was just trying to get me to get her to understand that I wasn't coming for her. I just, I literally had things that I felt like we needed to be better at, and I was passionate about it, you know. But we're yeah, here. Yeah. Communication, compromise. Yeah. But if you're in a relationship with someone, it's really hard for you to get through them. I would say if they're willing. You know, it might be worth the effort because it took me like a year and a half to like be a little like of a less selfish person. <laughs> okay, what's the best? What's the best thing about being with me since you hate life so much? Everything. I wish that I could spend more time with you because because even though we're opposite, like she completes me. Way like I'm so like. I don't know, go, go, go all the time and she's mellow and like when I get around her it's like yeah. my mellow and low time and then I kind of am the one that sparks her to do more go, 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 if that makes sense. Like, yeah, that's We true. just like balance each other so I she's really my best friend, I want to go everywhere and hang out with her. I really get upset when like I get to do things and she's working or something, I'll be like, oh my god, how am I doing this without Kier? It was like not cool. Yeah, we're very opposite in a good way. I'm like super chill, but I know for me the best thing about being with Amber is that she makes me a better person. So she's like the mm -hmm. first person to come into my life and be like, uh, no bitch, you know. And like in the end, it really has made me a better person. <laughs> Yay! Finally, I don't think I'm ways. bullying you. No, I don't. Progress. In past relationships, I was babied a lot. Like I was never wrong. Then Amber was the first person to be like, no, you're wrong. Who takes longer to get ready? We have to answer that. <laughs> um, Amber recently told me that she likes when I do more natural, subtle makeup. So I think now I get ready really fast, like a lot faster than I used to. Like, Here's so fast. crazy. Like she swears, like when she wakes up, and I'll be like, "Oh, baby, you're so beautiful." She thinks I'm lying. Like I like it. I love. I love you for you. You don't need to put on this makeup. Okay. Ashton looks a lot like Amber. Who's hotter? <laughs> Ashton. I'm not trying to I be don't hot. Even know. Okay, why would you even have me compare my girlfriend to her sister? 
If you could trade any trait with the other person, what would it be and why? If you could take any of my traits. The not, I don't give a fuck trait. <laughs> when yeah. things go wrong, I care a lot to the point where I'm upset. Kira's like, whatever. The way that Amber can go zero to a hundred, like as soon as she feels disrespected in any way, it doesn't matter who you are. That comes in handy sometimes. When well, cable think... messes up on our bill or like mm -hmm. when someone gets our order wrong. We get our money back and some. Yeah, she always gets the refund. Oh my God, I thought you hate it when I do that. And, I do, but I, I know it at the same time. And I know you you say you think I hate it when you're so like lollygag, but That's we would true. we would be like yeah. I hate it when you go zero to hundred on me. Yeah, but when you know do you to other people, it's really sexy. Like really sexy. Thanks, baby. It's sexy when you yell at me sometimes too. <laughs> do you guys go through public criticism because of your relationship? I think at the beginning, like the the criticism was like, oh, you guys aren't gonna last, you know, blah 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 blah. But okay, we're here two and a half later, so all them haters didn't shut up, <laughs> you yeah. know. So it's fine. Or or people just thinking that we they don't understand why we're together when we could both be with men. I guess. What? I see that. You know, because we're two women. I think that's what they meant. Ew. Right? I didn't mean criticism because of me and you being together. I'm pretty sure they meant criticism because we're two women in a relationship. And yeah, that happened. <laughs> okay, my question is why doesn't Amber like people touching her neck and what do you think about it? <laughs> I hate the feeling of being touched on my neck. It's gross. Don't touch my neck. <laughs> On that end. <laughs> it's just really, I do it all day long to her because I think it's so adorable. Please don't do it. We hate it. I'd rather you grab No, but it's the worst so. when I, we're trying to have a sexy moment and I do it accidentally. It'll kill the whole the mood. The vibe's like, gone. She's just done if I touch her neck. Like, Come back at me in an hour. Uh, do we want kids in the future and do we want marriage in the future? We talk about this all the time. Yeah. We go back and forth daily with wanting kids daily yeah it really is um if we do have kids would we want to adopt or have them we talk about this all the time too i think we got it down we are not sure if this can happen yet but we want to find one donor and we want twins we want to take one of my eggs one of her eggs and either implant them in care or a surrogate we don't know where life's gonna take us of course mm -hmm. and then have twins and they'll have the same dad they'll be one of us and they'll yeah. be sisters yeah, I think brothers that'd be, or one yeah. Each. that'd be the best option i think Two girls. Yeah. No, I mean one boy, one girl. <laughs> Who wears the pants in their relationship? Me, duh. How do you both feel about each other's boobs? I love Amber's boobs. I love her boobs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I would say they're my favorite things. Really? Well, I don't know. No, I can't say that because your eyes, your, your booty, everything. <laughs> that was my favorite thing. You're making me <laughs> Okay, what about Amber attracted you to her? And initially, I just liked how she, she just commanded attention. I don't know what it is. Her looks or her presence or something, she just, I just looked at her and I was like, she's a boss. And that attracted me to her a lot. Okay, when did you and Amber know that you were each other's true love? I'm still trying to figure that out. Um, you don't have to answer it if it's not, if you're still figuring it out. No, I'm just playing. Oh. Um, <laughs> are you upset? <laughs> you little. You were really there by my side when I went through things and you sometimes people might be scared off and you were right there and you were like, yep, got your back. Mm -hmm. And um, I think those moments in my life were really like, wow, this is, this is my ride or die. Okay, I don't, I don't know if I've ever told you this. So I'm gonna go really fast. So when we, it's like when we first started dating and she was sleeping at my house at the time and she went out without me and um, then I, like the club let out at like two and it was like three and I couldn't get a hold of her. And I remember I just sat in my apartment and I started crying. Like my mind didn't even go, oh is she cheating on me? My mind went to, oh my God, is she okay? Is she, has she been arrested? Is she kidnapped? Like, I care about this person more than I care about myself. Like all I wanted is to figure out where she was, and Aww, you I was just so worried about her. And I was like, wow, like I'm really in love with this person. And this was only after like three months. What happened? What, what was I doing? 
Uh, talking to the owner. Oh like yeah. You always do. Everywhere yeah. she goes, she ends up meeting the owner. I think I knew I loved you when you sat there and watched me play video games. I knew you were a keeper. Really? Yeah, that's a big deal. You know what I mean? Like, you've just been supportive in whatever it is. Video yeah. games, whatever, poker, whatever boring stuff I've been doing. You've been like, hey, baby, I'm right here. Okay, so that was our little girlfriend tag. I hope you guys liked it. I definitely want to do another one, like, a little bit later. Thank you for coming in my bathroom, because I know this is, like, torture for you. Torture. Anything, baby. <laughs> mm. Bye, you guys. It was nice meeting Kira's friends. Yes. Mm. Okay, bye friends. I'll see you next week. I have something really fun planned for next week, and I hope you guys like it. I'm actually going to start working on it tomorrow, but I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye. And can you even, like, climb over this stuff daily and use this toilet? This is a storage room. Well, I have to pee, like, sideways. <laughs> Do you like that? Is that okay with you? <laughs> it's to it's throw that away. Tutu. Why is there a tutu in your bathroom? I don't have a place for my shoes, and I don't have enough counter space. So you yeah, have the biggest counter in our house. What is this thing? That's jewelry in my waist puncher bag. Trash. No, no, it's not trash. Oh, what is this? What is this? What is this thing? That might be trash. Trash. Hey, look at this, you guys. Look at it it's in the bathroom. You know what? Oh, you <laughs> You need to leave those on. They're so fucking cute. Oh, we went to Disneyland. It was so cute. But why do you have these? Just like on the top of your counter like you wear them daily. Memories. Duh. So, Do it. Mm. This is the face that I love the most. Mm. What's wrong, babe? My What's wrong, babe? You're my business. Why aren't you feeling? Mm -hmm. Eating dinner for you. Oh yeah, let's do it. I worked ah. 10 hours today and now there's dinner in the oven. Oh, okay. Yeah. And now Amber's gone. Okay, goodbye. Bye guys.